Uh, just to start by, uh, I'll be quick. First, a word of thanks uh, for all the panelists, all the speakers, to uh, Greece and Singapore, uh, the EdTech Hub as co-leads, and our colleagues in the UN, uh, UNICEF, uh, ITU, the World Bank, UNHCR, for all the work uh, that has brought us together. The key word is really around collective intelligence, and the work that has been done by the Action Track builds on uh, the Secretary General's roadmap uh, for digital cooperation. It builds on the report of the International Commission on the Futures of Education, and it builds more specifically on the Global Rewired Declaration on Connectivity for Education. Um, and I think today was an excellent example of bringing together also that uh, what we need going forward looking at the summit in, 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 in September is to bring in the specific expertise and the experience of uh, the diversity of partners on the how. Um, just to tie this, and this is my final word, and then I'll have a housekeeping announcement to make, but to tie this to the discussion on transforming uh, education and the Transforming Education Summit more broadly, there is no transformation of, of education without addressing the root causes of social exclusions. And one manifestation of the social exclusions is the digital divide. And re addressing that from the technical dimension goes beyond uh, the education sector. But I think this is one message we can take uh, a more, a more broadly looking across the thematic tracks. There's no transformation of education without addressing the root causes of educational exclusion and with what concerns us with digital learning, that's the issue or the manifestation of the digital divide. Second, there's no transformation of education without, without transformative teaching and learning. So we need a transformation of teaching and learning and the two principles that we have heard uh, from the discussion paper have to do with um, digital learning content um, has to do with um, uh, exploiting the full uh, pedagogical capacities offered by, uh, by digital uh, uh, technologies uh, in, in teaching and learning. And third, there's no transformation of education without transformation of the governance of education. Um, and uh, considering digital learning content, they have to be considered part of the global uh, uh, digital commons. We need to commit to democratic participatory governance, protection of uh, uh, data privacy. And so these are all aspects that we see cutting across all the thematic tracks and, 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 with the, um, and, and our focus today on, on the digital learning. So I just wanted to tie that into the broader efforts around transformation and what might be expected <clears throat> in September as key elements of transformation of education. Finally, an announcement, housekeeping, just to say ministerial videos uh, will be um, uh, screened in room one at 2.45. And in room 11, um, currently, is a side event on digital open schools. Thank you very much. Thank you all, and thank you for uh, uh, the moderation.